One, two, three. Hello, welcome to Ost uh, Milan 2015. I'm Luca Bezzera and uh, I work for the, my family uh, company and I'm the sales manager for the export of our espresso coffee machine. We are presenting during this uh, edition of uh, Ost the new model of espresso coffee machine Arcadia. The Arcadia machine have a brewing profile system and a special program to brew filter coffee with the espresso coffee machine. So these are the, the, the main feature of our new project. Now we are here with the first prototype of our uh, line that soon will be, um, uh, will be proposed in one group, two group and three groups. So if you want to have a closer look of the feature of our machine, I can show you with, from the main uh, um, display of the machine, you can uh, have the control of the steam function. You have three different steam program by which you can program three different foam texture, from the hot milk without uh, foam to the silky foam latte art style to the um, let's say much more foamy um, texture than for the cappuccino. So once that I, I program my, my push button, I store the program and the related push button will act following the presetting that I've done. On the other side I have the T function where I have three different uh, uh, program for tea by which I can uh, uh, mix fresh water coming from the tap with the hot water of the boiler. So the, the mixing of the fresh water gives a better quality to the, to the water used to make the tea, so I don't use just water coming from the boiler, and a law to uh, regulate the temperature of, of the tea. Especially in Southeast Asia, there are a lot of uh, different kinds of tea that request different temperatures. That's why we have developed this system. Mm. Okay. Now, in the, in the main uh, display, we can see the temperature of the boiler, pressure of the boiler, and water level in the boiler. And we can control also the group. This is the group setting uh, um, uh, interface where I have four different uh, uh, temperature range that I can program from the green that is the colder temperature up to the, up to the red area that is the hottest temperature that I can program. It, it, the, this range goes from 87 to 96 Celsius degree. Now, when I want to program a, an espresso coffee dose, I act on the display pushing a button. When I'm happy about the quantity of coffee that I get into my cup, I push again on the same button. Now the computer automatically tells me the amount of water that I have used to brew my coffee and to get the result uh, in my cup. So this tell you that in this case tell me that I have used 76 milliliter of water in order to um, to have the, the the coffee that I had in my cup. In this 76 milliliter of water are divided in three segments. What each of these segments can be um, programmed with a different pressure and with a different, uh, uh, and they can also increase or decrease the amount of water of the segment. So how we do? We go on the segment, we push, and we have two buttons. One is water and the other one is pressure. If I want, for example, increase the pressure of the first segment to get the best from my coffee when the coffee is not uh, um, wetted already, I can increase, for example, a 10 bar. I want to have my first part of the brew in a 10 bar longer, so I want much more coffee. I can go on milliliter 
and increase from 25 to 30 milliliter. Second phase of the brewing. I already get the best from my coffee at 10 bar, so I can decrease from the 9 bar that the computer proposes you to 6 bar. I go on the last phase of the um, brewing and I already get all the good of my coffee. I just need a little bit more water, so I decrease the pressure to 4 bar in order to avoid to get the, 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 the roast part of the espresso. After that I can choose the uh, pre-infusion. So I have, the, before the, the, um, the red line, I have a scale that tells me how many milliliters of pre-infusion I want to do. So let's say I set 7 milliliters of pre-infusion and after the 7 milliliter I stop the solenoid valve for one second. Now I can test my, um, my program before to store those data in the computer and to give a name to my profile. On the main screen I can read the pressure and I have a timer and the temperature of the group that I'm using. So now I am in the second phase of the brewing, so I decrease from 10 bar to 6 bar. Now I am in the last phase of the brewing and I am at 4 bar. Okay, uh, according to the, my, to the customer taste and to the, to the quality of coffee that he is using, I can change this program, uh, change the temperature and change the pressure of brewing. Apart from, uh, from, from the brewing profile system, we offer the opportunity to brew filter coffee with this espresso coffee machine. So we have preset a program for, for, fil for filter coffee in order to avoid the overflow of water from this filter. So in accordance to the capacity of your filter uh, you can program uh, you can program the machine to pour water and in order to obtain American coffee. So now we wet the filter in order to avoid to have the taste of, of paper in our cup. We grind the coffee. We prepare, just removing the grid and flushing the group, we prepare the working area in order to, um, to use our filter system, a traditional filter system. Now I have presetted the program and I have uh, um, programmed the machine to act this program every time I push this button. Now, as you can see, the machine did a sort of frame fusion and the coffee is blooming and the little bubble are coming out. And after it stopped, 
in order to let the water come down. Now it starts again. This program can be presented for any size of filter because it is done manually by the operator. When you are happy with the, with the sequence of brewing and you are happy with that, you can store the data and every time you push this button, you will have this cycle of start and stop of the brewing. With such a system, we can dedicate one group to filter coffee, the other group to espresso coffee, and uh, avoiding to have someone that is pouring slowly, slowly the water on the uh, filter coffee, we can serve better our customer and faster our customer without uh, um, uh, influencing the quality of the filtered coffee because I can regulate the temperature, I can regulate the amount of water and I can regulate the flow of my water that goes on, on, the, on the coffee. Want, want to try? I'll give you. Food for Mr. Tesfaye. One for you. This is a single origin from uh, Ethiopia. Want? So thank you for uh, this interview and for the opportunity to show our new product. Thank you very much.